you can use lists or arrays in Python. A list is a collection and this contains several one, zero or more elements. And so I could have a list of scores and this could have several numbers. And that's how you would define a list. You can print the whole list like this. Run it and you'll see the whole list of items. To get the first item, you'd write this to specify that you want just an item and then you need to specify the item index. So we start counting from zero. So this is the zeroth element, first element, second element, third element, fourth element and so on. So zero is the first element and if you would run this, you'll see it's the first element of this list. Now to get the, the second element, we'll just change it to one. So I'll show the second element. If you want to see the last element, you'd probably think that you need the, the size of this list and then minus one, but that's not the case. You can just type minus one here and that will get the last element. So that's the last element of this list. To add items to this list, you can use the append method and in this line specify what you want to add to this list. So now we add, let's say some, some big number, run it and you'll see the number is or the item is added to the end of the list. Now to, to remove an item you can use the pop method run it, you'll see the item is added, but it's also removed again. So we end up with an identical list, just clear it, run it, and you'll see the list is identical. Now if you were to specify an index that's too high, so let's say print index 20, there is no 20th element, you'd get an error because the number, the index number, is larger than the amount of elements. Now you can spec delete a certain item, so let's say del the fourth index and let's print both before and after. Run it and you'll see one the fourth element has been removed and using this del uh, command. Now if you use the remove function it removes the first occurrence of a number. So let's say we have another type of list uh, let's say three shows up several times and then we say remove three the scores. You'll see the it removed the first time the three appeared, but it didn't remove the others. And so if we were to remove, let's say, add some number here, seven, remove seven. You'll see seven is still in the list. So this remove method only removes the first element, first time this element appears in the list. Now to get a length of a list you can simply say x is length scores and then print x. So the length function will give you the length of the list. So there's nine elements in this list. So this sums up the basic lists. You can also combine lists if you want, so you have another list, you can say and then print x and you'll see both of the lists are now combined into one single list x and that really is, is a list in short. A list uh, can also contain text variables 
and so strings or any type of object. So you could have a list of um, animals, say whatever, and this would work similarly. So you could get the first element using the zeroth index and run it. You'll see that it gets the zeroth or the first element. So this is just how you use lists.